Very good morning to dear friends. First of all, I wish you all best of luck for tomorrow's your English examination. Yesterday, we have gone through to find the answer for uh, question number 26 that is uh, complete the following uh, by filling the blanks using the right form of the verb given in brackets. Yesterday I told you that there are this is in passive form that means generally the given sentence is as I have observed till today from observing many last previous question papers the sentence is in past tense we have to fill the blanks with passive form passive form yesterday I have told you I am repeating once again there are two important points first one is be or to be verb and another one is past participle of the verb given in brackets these two are very important before this one you have to identify in which tense the given sentence is I have told you I am repeating you generally most probably the given sentence will be in past tense but how to find out this whether the tense is present or past in the given sentence by reading carefully the sentence given in your question paper you can come to know in which tense the given sentence is for example this one the kinglet felt it very expensive to keep the criminal in the prison so the guard dash bracket dismiss and the criminal dash into bracket pay one third of anybody in advance and dash into bracket ask to leave the country in these two sentences in first one in these two sentences or three sentences where we can find the tense of the verb or the tense of the sentence for example this felt is in past tense because we can have feel the main root verb of this verb is feel this is felt and felt this is past participle and this is past tense so felt it is this verb is in past tense so we have to use in these blanks past tense form of the verb be verb past tense form of the verb be verb means was or where these two was should be used wherever there is a singular subject and where wherever there is plural subject and then now let us solve this question the kinglet felt it very expensive to keep the criminal in the prison. We have to write as it is. The sentence as it is you have to write in your answer paper. If you do not write the sentences given here in your question paper, you will lose marks. There is most probability of losing marks. So the guard dash dismiss. The guard here is guard is third person singular form so this is should be the was because past tense form of the verb is was so the card was dismissed this is was and dismissed because dismiss the past participle of the verb dismiss is Dismiss, dismiss, and dismiss. Three forms of the verb are there. Dismiss, and that means the was dismissed. 
That means, so the guard was dismissed and the criminal, again this criminal is third person and singular and so there should be was. The criminal was paid because pay, the first principle of the pay is paid. Was paid one third of the enemy in advance and dash asked and was asked. Who is asked? The criminal and was asked because he was asked. One third of the enemy at once. He liberated one sentence. And the criminal was asked, was asked to leave the country. For example, ignore it. Either Uttra head or head. You have to write, I am repeating you, I am recalling you that you have to write the full sentences given in your question paper. For example, the kinglet felt it very expensive to keep the criminal in the prison. So the guard, elaborated Nana, was dismissed. And the criminal was paid in advance, the enemy in advance, and was asked. To leave the country, the answer is like this. I will again write the sentence. Give attention. The kinglet felt as it is, felt it very expensive. to keep the criminal in prison. He live a in the prison. So, the guard here it is dash was because guard third person singular for was dismiss the past participle of dismiss is dismissed was dismissed you have to underline this one or you have to drop this one was dismissed and the criminal again was paid paid was paid Underline this one was paid one third of one third of enemy in advance and again the criminal was asked was asked you have to underline this one was asked to leave the country. In the country. So, what is the answer? The kinglet felt it very expensive to keep the criminal in the prison. So, the guard was dismissed. Here it is. So, the guard was dismissed and the criminal was paid. Ili dash paid. Was paid one third of enemy in advance and was asked. Ilbari dash ask ishtaya was asked to leave the country. Why we have used past tense? Because here the tense of the verb is past. So the whole sentence should be in past tense. Past possible form of the verb plus past form of the B verb. That is was. Ili Kinglet felt it very expensive. The guard it is a singular third person. So I have used the was and the criminal again third person singular person singular it is was and the criminal was asked again it is was asked. Is to that you will get three marks. And the next one.
This is somewhat different. Here, by reading the sentence, one cannot easily get in what tense the sentence is. Because here, at the outset, we can't find any past form of the verb. See, in 1991, literacy drive dash undertake by Sheila Churani Chukar, mobility was dash included as a part of literacy drive, banks dash push to give loans for the women to buy bicycles. Where is the past tense of the form in this sentence? If we read carefully the sentence, we can get one word. This is 1991. Because 1991 is not present, it is past year. So, this is this given sentence is in past tense. How this can be solved? In the 1991 literacy drive, I will write here. In 1991, the literacy drive dash literacy drive it is a third person singular form literacy drive was undertake undertake the past participle of undertake is undertake undertook and undertake so we have to use this one was undertaken you have to underline this one bare hage prepare underline marte beku was undertaken by shila rani chunkat mobility next sentence mobility Dash include mobility is also third person singular and so we will use was include include included was included underline this one was included as a part of of literacy drive. Then banks. See here. Salupa Lakshmore. Iliella. Literacy drive by Sira Rani Chukat. Mobility. Third person singular form. Part of literacy drive. Anita Vasu Yokshiti. Ilimene. Gardo. Singular. Vasu Yokshiti. Criminal singular. Vasu Yokshiti. Now the banks. It is plural. Bank is singular and banks the plural. So plural it is a past tense. So bank singular kanana was used but here it is banks plural. We have to use where banks where push where push 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 to give. Loans for the loans for the woman to buy bicycles. See, I will tell you again. In 1991, this itself tells us that the sentence is in past tense. In 1991, because the year is has gone, it is past. In 1991, literacy drive was, it is singular, was undertake, undertaken, was undertaken by Srila Rani Chunkar. The first sentence. The next sentence, mobility dash include, mobility was included as a part of literacy drive. And then banks, plural form, third person plural form, banks were pushed to give loans for the women to buy bicycles. This completes the answer. You will get 3 marks. Okay? 